Noida time? It is Noida time. Let's do this. Where's Noida? Noida is updated again. How often do they update this beta? Constantly. Are they even really making updates? I don't understand the update log. Like, how does it always say this? Explain yourself, game. April 4th. Weird. I... Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's good. I like the updates. It just confuses me. I'm easily confused. What are we doing? We just killed Steve. Scott. One of the two. One of the two of them. Right. We're going down into the scary area. I can dig through brick, but very slowly. Cool. Hmm. This is a laser eye. It does nothing. It can do things. I don't know what it can do. It can dig. It can fight. But not well. What have I done? Oh, there's a trap right there. Oops. I was gonna show off the laser eye. My damage is not good enough. No, what am I doing? What am I doing? Now we're out of mana. And I want that gold. And what is up with that ground? This crystal scares me. I don't like being next to it. This thing puts out little tentacles and it freezes you. What is down there? A trap. I don't know what's up with this. This thing looks weird. It's very tanky, I think. I don't like you. Stay away from me. Stay away from me. Get away. Okay. How are we doing? 435. Okay. Of all the areas, this is the one that I know the least. I mean, all of the main areas. There are side areas that I know nothing about, like the meat world. Okay, so, laser thing. This doesn't do much. Early in the game, it can be good. This acid is actually shooting through the wall, this trap and causing destruction to the world for free for me. Thank you, Acid Trap. Okay, I don't like you. These aren't even hard enemies, if you know what they do. I thought that they shot out like purple death, but in reality, they do melee attacks. I know what the tentacle flying big thing does. We have decent gold. That's another Acid Trap. So Acid Trap, you want to fight it from above. That is a light monster. I don't like fighting the light things. Of everything in this area, they are probably one of the tankiest. I think they're just very resistant to most damage types that I use. So don't go to the right. Ticks are also annoying. Ghost ticks cannot be hurt, but if you kill the center that they are chained to, then they die. But that's kind of a pain to do because they sit there and circle around it. It's easy if you have black holes. That looks like a max HP wizard. I don't like walking by two crystals. If these explode, when I'm near them, I don't want to kick it. I think they would kill me. One of them causes an earthquake. Earthquakes do stupid amounts of damage. Like crazy, okay, I wanted the gold, but that was stupid. Crazy amounts of damage. And they do it very fast. Give me the gold. What are you doing here? I don't think this is actually scary. It just looks scary. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I did not realize that it did that.
The light thing is way over to the right. Slightly over to the right. I should be able to get by it if we just go down here. All right. This thing is like straight over to the left. Well, no, it's down. Down and to the left. It's quite a bit down. No, that's the light thing. It's through a wall. It cannot get me. The light thing isn't real. It can't hurt me. Those zoom at me. Nope. Teleport. Hard counters those. If I use the teleport. But I, if I don't use the teleport, it does not counter them. There's another. But there's some pixels in my way. Get the pixels out of the way. Here, I can clear out the pixels. Nope. I want that gold. Did those just rush at each other? I don't need the gold. I just want it. I want that light thing to stay away from me. It's freaking me out, man. Not another. I'm trying to collect gold. These crits. Stop! Stop, stop, just kill it. Because of the blood, we're getting so many crits right now. <clears throat> blood. It doesn't tell me how much it increases it. Do not dig through this sand. It would release the light monster. Do not do that. Red crystal. If it causes an earthquake, it's not bad. Let's assume it causes an earthquake. It does cause earthquakes. So as long as you're far away, earthquakes aren't bad. There's a second tick. This is becoming chaos. I don't have a great way to dig. I mean, I could dig through this, but I don't want to go into this chaos. I can teleport past the tip, but then I have something behind me, kind of trapping me in. And I don't like teleporting aggressively forward into the unknown. I could go up here. Oh, that was way too far forward. Oh, trap. Acid trap. Luckily, ticks are slow. Don't get stuck. It's not this enemy itself that's bad. It's that enemy combined with other things at the same time that becomes very bad. Two ticks becomes much worse. So like right now. Okay, blow this up. Hit, is it four or three? Three. This tick should be up here somewhere. Okay. See, like, right now, I don't really want to fight that thing while I'm looking for the center of the tick, and I'm running out of hover. Okay, let's just collect the gold. And if we had lava below us, the game just quickly becomes chaos. Where is this center? It should be right around here. Is it right there? Oh, it's right there. Okay. There was a purple enemy in there. That thing shoots purple stuff at me. I don't think of the purple stuff as being particularly scary. But all of the enemies in this area are pretty tanky, including this one. Not my best teleport. Cool. Kill that. You don't want to stand next to it because it does frozen death. Whatever. We will kill it. Come with me. <clears throat> Get some blood. I don't want to stand next to it. I can't really hit it because it's getting buried. Do I have a way to unbury it? I do, but I don't want to use up those shots. 
I could. Huh. All right. Just, it's dead. The tick disappears. See, frozen death. Okay, so that gives me more breathing room. A worm looks like it came down here. But it's only a medium worm. At this point, medium worms are not scary. These enemies are scarier. And they're not even that scary. You can't shoot through this gap, can you? Maybe you could. Oh no, I don't know what this wizard is. That might be a polymorph wizard. I don't actually know. That's just Earthquake. So Earthquake, I can shoot the red crystals. I see lots of acid damage. What caused that? Orbals are dropping. Where are you dropping from? Orbal. Oh, I didn't see you. That was stupid. So can we find this center? It's probably, ooh, max HP. Acid monster. Nope, don't fall into the tick. Nope, don't get frozen by that. I don't have many shots left. Make this one count. Darn. Oh, there's the center. It's after an acid trap. Oh, I can't get in there. Lame. Super lame. Super lame. All right, to get in there. What would I do? Chainsaw? Probably. Chainsaw is going to be very slow to dig through this. Oh, acid. Acid can get me through. The problem is I don't want to be standing right next to the crystal. Acid, shoot me. Shoot me. Shoot me. Darn it. Is there blood? There's a little bit of blood. Is that enough? Maybe. Oops. If I could get crits on that, I could have killed it before it got buried. I can teleport in there, but it's a little bit scary. <clears throat> did all of that powder drop out? Oh, it did. Okay, that makes it easy. I mean, I have to wait for it to drain out again. Don't run out of cover. Cool, we killed the tick. I could be going a lot faster, but I take a lot more damage if I go a lot faster. Oh, I don't know if you scare me. Huh, maybe you don't. That green crystal does scare me. It creates cursed earth. I don't think I want to get hit by that. Just guessing. If I create enough dust, then that thing becomes trapped. So this red crystal would cause a chain reaction that blows up the green crystals. And the green crystals are death. What is going on down here, though? There's sparkly scariness. Is that lava? I think that's lava. 
could I get a shot to go through this? I think it's too thick. Every once in a while, you can get a shot to like glitch through in weird ways, especially with bouncing burst. If it goes at a weird angle, it can travel really fast. But I don't think we can glitch through something that quick. Or that thick. That quick, that thick. You know, words. Um, hmm. Oh, what just hit me? That field. Also, that's not a scary enemy, so that's good to know. This looks like a way down. Probably all the way to the bottom. I was supposed to find a strong wand in here. That thing has a wand. What did it just shoot me with? Nothing important. The funny thing is, it just shot me with the spark bolt. That enemy is actually less scary with that wand than it is default. Just because wizards are scary. Okay. Stupid tick. I don't know what this enemy does exactly. By which I mean, I don't know what it does at all. I wonder if it's bleeding slime blood because I bleed slime blood. Because it looked a little bit like me. Okay. I'm guessing that's the case. Does it always bleed slime is my question. That wand wizard is still down there. Okay, now it's dead. No, it's not. Huh. Okay. We're fine. This is fine. It hits me with those spark bolts way too often. Why are you so strong? It is hitting me. I mean, at least it's not casting spells. It should be blowing itself up. This stupid tick. Can you fit through? It looks like you can find your way through the maze. Yup. You do produce blood for me, at least. Okay. Do I need- I need to fight that wizard because it has a wand. Normally, I would not need to fight it. Huh. I need to see that wand. Die! I'm doing, like, no damage to it, and I don't know why. Die! It's so bad. It's actually good. Darn it. What do I get rid of? This vacuum bounce? The mana charge speed is better than this mana charge speed. The recharge time is workable. It casts two spells, and it has nine slots instead of eight. It's workable. It's a, like, slight improvement. This is a lot of blood. With this blood, I can kill this thing before it reaches me, if it gives me straight line of sight. Nope! My hover ran out. At an inopportune time. Okay. Keep fighting these, we're still bloody. That was a bad teleport. It worked out, but it could have been scary. This thing sends that stupid orb. Stupid orb. I got stuck on that little lip. Cool. Free gold. How much gold? 9,800. This should be the bottom. It is. So, running around the bottom is a little bit scary because everything is above me, so it's all ready to fall down on top of me. But, it's usually a little bit clear so that 
I can easily see if I see the sparkle of wands. Like you can move around more easily on the bottom, I would say. I don't know what you do. I don't want to find out. That's not always true. Sometimes things are blocked. But just getting to view all of this kind of freely. I need another wand. I found a slight improvement. We want better. We really want better at this point. This is easy to dig through. It's just wood. Wood and sand. Is there anything above me? like things falling from above. Those purple crystals are not bad, I don't think. I don't think. I don't know what they do. Okay, get the blood. The blood helps. Okay, but the gold blocks my shots. The gold blocks so many of my shots. Okay, we're good. Tell no teleport. I'm about to go heal anyways. So as long as my health doesn't get into risky territory. But this is not worth doing for the gold. This is worth doing for wands. If I can find a wand. I'm still gonna collect the gold. Gold has limited value now. I can only buy one thing at this shop, max. Maybe two if something's on sale, but I doubt it. And they would both have to be useful. Which is kind of rare. Early on, gold is more valuable. It's hard to dig through this. There's nothing good up there. I could go fight. The good news is this lava is blocked off. I kind of want to see what this pink crystal is. Okay. That pink crystal was worse than I thought. Only because I was standing next to it. Okay, that wizard bleeds a bunch of slime. That's what we learned. I'm very bloody. I'm out of mana. Ooh, it shot lightning at me. I think that's what it did. This wizard, don't let it shoot me. Don't let it bleed on me. All right, it created teleportanium. Ooh, I got good comments about flummox and four recipes you can do with it. What were the comments? Two of them don't matter too much. You can create pheromone using berserkium and flummox. You can create teleportanium and flummox into some weird polymorph that I'm not going to do during a good run, but that during a crazy run, we could try it for fun. There was another one that sounded really good. What was it? Why does my mind blank on the most important one? Thank you for the comment, by the way. Such good info. Um, what was it? It wasn't that hard of a recipe. Flummox plus something. And I don't know what it created. It created some new liquid that I've never seen or heard of. We're still looking for a wand. 262. Yeah. Oh no! That's... I don't like the light thing. That's why I don't like it. It's tanky and it reflects shots. It just messes up my day. Nope. I don't want to deal with the light thing. I'm trying to remember what the other... No! We lost that wizard earlier. No, wizard shot me. There, we found a wand, but I don't know where I am. I don't like this. 
I don't like this. Do not like. Please stop. That is a light monster, kind of. It's not a light monster, but it's like a cousin of the light monster. And there's these. Do not like. Do not like. I'm trapped. And I'm by a light monster. Teleport out. Teleport out. I just got hit. Damage? We're doing all right. Wait for something. I need to clear an area of safety. This is not an area of safety. That's an acid monster. Okay. Why are they like this? Get out of here. Get... That thing affects gravity. So we saw a wand over here. I think it was over here. This is a different area. But it's a scary area. Everything's scary. I said that I can blow up red crystals. Just stay away from them when they blow up. This is a scary area. Put out the lava. Is it scary? It's pretty scary. I am scared. As I continue to go forward. Put out as much... The lava will eat through these things. But as it does, I think it gets used up or something. I don't know. Lava's weird. Don't trap myself. That was a dead end. If something came in through here, it would have been scary. 214 HP. I saw a good wand and I want it! Not the teleport wizard. Hey! We're down here. I could heal. Oh no! Don't point it down. That's instant death. Oh no. Steven's got her here. If I would have teleported into the lava, I lost the video game. So, you, with normal teleport, you teleport whichever direction you're pointed. Scary thing now. This is Big Scott. Big Steve. Big whichever. It's not the little one that I've been fighting this whole time. Here, we don't need this, we don't need this, we don't need this. The triple cast could be good. I want this. Cooldowns are a little bit worse right now. Four. That's worse. We're getting there. I have another chainsaw. Can I take this off? Yes, I can. It's completely mana stable. Can I put crit on there? I think I can. That slows it down. To speed it up, I would have to put this chainsaw at the start. But if I do that, I can only cast at half speed. Oh no, I need to add another double cast. That's what I needed. It does drain mana, but it does significantly more damage. The other thing would be not to put this and just put another spark bolt, which will also drain mana. But, oh no. It does not drain as much mana. Hmm. So the other thing I could do is you put a chainsaw here. Take this off. Put this here. Put this here. Put this here. Put this here. And I think that works. And we've got the crit in there. I think at most this can only shoot 15 times a second or whatever it is. Half speed. I think. Because half the time it's just doing a single chainsaw. So my thought process is to still do this one and add in the chainsaw at the end. Wait, that's worse. What's going on? We cast three... No, I cast four spells. Weird. Is that weird? Feels weird. Oh. I thought I had figured this out. 
did I just have a chainsaw at the start? I mean, that will do it. Then, do I even need that? I do. Game is weird. Game is weird. I swear the game is weird. Why does that work? Okay. Wait, that seems fine, I think. The only thing would be... If I want it to be a more narrow beam, I would use this instead. It does drain a little bit of mana every cast, which kind of sucks. If I had two of these, I would use that. This drains more mana, but it does more damage. Oh, I was trying to get the third spark bolt in there. Third bolt, spark bolt, screws up everything. I mean, we should be fine, even against the big Steve Scott double shield, whatever your name is. Oh, right, you eat through. Okay. I did not mean to get that spell refresher. I don't know if a statue kills this one. Let's assume it does. Oh, it might eat through it. It ate through it. I can't cast. Why can I not cast? It's on four. I'm just going to go over here. I haven't healed yet. Saving grace. Let's take it. Should I need saving grace? Hopefully I don't. I should have dodged that. I'm not used to this shooting two shots. Okay, I'm not used to this enemy, period. Oh, I did take the heal already. Okay, just give me a second. Oh, there's lava. It's on four, not on one. Okay. Let's get up close. Kick! Did I kill it with the kick? Okay. So, my HP is gone. That thing destroyed me. This spell does not work at killing that enemy. Holy 26 slot. Oh, it has a recharge time that makes it unusable. 3.52 seconds. I'm pretty sure 26 slot is as good as it gets, again with the recharge time. This has projectile area teleport. This has freeze charge. So, the question now, and it has quadruple spell, which could be good. It also has quadruple scatter, which is interesting. Question now, would I pay 4300 for freeze? Answer, probably. 10 slot with almost as good of mana charge speed. Better delays. Only cast one spell. This is an improvement, I think. 10 slots. This one is garbage. This one is a 24 slot with, oh, it's shuffle. Okay, this has a lot of interesting things. It has piercing, which scares me, but it can be a good heal, and it can be good damage. Holy Lance. A fast-flying, penetrating lance that glows with power. I see holy damage. I see explosion radius. I see explosion damage. This could be really good. The problem is I hesitate to try new things in this game because... Trying new things means you're probably going to die while you figure out how they work. I guess we're not super far into a run. I could do it. This black hole is worth getting as well. God, I was, wish this was not a shuffle. I could use this double spell too. I have room. Huh. So, I think it's this wand. Especially, it's on sale. And this wand. Sadly, the recharge time 
the always cast, and the mana charge speed are all garbage. Huh. Okay. So, this is the spell that I want. Cool. Could take reduce spread. Could take quad cast. Could take another quad cast. Could take this. I've already got one of these. No bounce can sometimes be useful. Necromancy never does anything for me, but maybe it's good. This wand is crap. Where do I put crap wands? Crap wands go in the swimming pool. That's not the right wand. This is crap. God, this would be so good. It still could be. You just shoot one spell every 3.52 seconds. It has a thousand max mana. I could change up the way I'm doing things. This could be broken. Explosion on slimy. I do have explosion immunity and we create slime. Maybe I should just think about making a super single shot. Recharge time. Oh, now I don't have money. I could still buy this one. Whoa. Oh, the problem with this one is that it's a shuffle. But it's still good. Fireworks cost 70. They're an explosive. Where was that holy lance thing? Explosion on slimy. Could be good. Oh, this casts 26 spells at once. Oh, God. Oh, God. How does that work if you use, like, with trigger? So, hopefully this is not going to light me on fire or anything stupid. With trigger does not work. These have unlimited uses. This is cast delay. So, this one doesn't do anything. I guess it doesn't need a payload. What would I do with this? What would I do with this? Happy random spell. Doesn't do much, but I guess it's cheap. I don't know. I'm trying to think. Normally with a 26 slot that has that kind of recharge, I would want all of it to go inside of a spark bolt with trigger or something. But right now, I don't know what I would want. I guess projectile area teleport is good. Venomous curse is good. Reduce recharge time. Yeah, I mean, it's worth putting on there. Auto aim could get me in trouble. I'm pretty sure a rock would just get blown up. Holy, we're doing things. Did you see how cool that looked? What are the chances I just blow up? This cast delay. Okay. That was because of these projectile area teleports. The rock is just getting blown up. I don't think it does anything. Energy orb. Energy orb does not do much. It's kind of fun. All right. So what am I doing with this wand? Nothing. Let's switch our wand positions. This can go up here. This can go up here. This wand. Wait. So, we know this wand is decent. How is this one? It's not as good. What is going on? Move this. Move this. Move this. I'm going to take this off. Put this on. Super accurate teleports. We have plenty of mana on this one, so I can just use it to store the triple casts. And we can put this on there. So now... Yeah, this can shoot plenty fast. That wand goes on two. This wand is crazy. This one's also decent. 
So piercing is important. Pinpoint of light. This adds to cast delay. Why would I add to the cast delay? Black hole's important. This would destroy me. But if I got melee immunity, that could be good. This one was one of the spells that I wanted. Dormant crystal with trigger. A crystal that explodes and casts another spell when caught in an explosion. There are things you can do with this. I don't know what they are. Giant magic missile. That is a thing that I would like. Can't use Giga Death Cross. Floating Arc. We could do Floating Arc, I guess. More fireworks. We could do more fireworks. The question is, can any of these do damage to me? I'm looking at you, Holy Lance. Because if they can, then with Piercing... Well, no. Piercing would make all of them do damage to me. But with Venomous... Just in general, they could destroy me. Not using this. Not using this. Not using this. I could use this. Do I have enough mana? Not using this. I don't know what this does. Giant Firebolt. I don't know if I need Explosion on Slimy, but maybe I do. More than a Firework. Probably. We could get boxes of TNT, except they'll light me on fire. I feel like this is pretty good. We could get minecarts. Again, they might light me on fire. And I think they would get blown up. So now... Those just went zooming off. So... Here's the question. Can that lance hurt me? Can that purple hurt me? Oh! Do not like! Do not like! I can't wash it off or anything. We got our answer. Listen, I don't want to find that out in the middle of combat. Yeah, that was a little bit stupid. Yeah, that was a little bit stupid. I don't think any of the rest of these can hurt me. I don't know about that purple glow that happens. This purple when this one explodes. Also, it doesn't seem super necessary. That scares me. So this one does not hurt me, but this, 153. I mean, the real test is to shoot it right next to myself. Mana's not a problem. Recharge time is a problem. Recharge time is a problem. How much do these add? They add so much cast delay. I don't know if cast delay is the problem. I guess it's fine. Oh, it's not fine. Cast delay is the problem. These add too much cast delay. Take them off. I just got this. Cast delay plus two sec. Oh, every one of these adds tons of cast delay. That's why you put these into a spark bolt with trigger because it gets rid of the cast delay. The other thing that could get rid of the cast delay is if I put a chainsaw. But I'm using my chainsaws. Do I need the chainsaws? I do. I thought I just got a new wand. Huh. That's better. That's because I put that chainsaw at the end. This wand would go wild, I think. Like, it could be made better, but it's pretty decent. Um, so now, my main wand. To fix my main wand. What's going on? 
this wants to go where? Right there? Negative. So what's going on? We cast two spells. Cast three spells. Um, why is this number so hard for me to figure out? This adds two more spells. Right? So we cast five spells, I think, which is excessive. That is excessive. I had another double cast. Isn't this plenty? That is plenty. I'm just not reducing the delays enough. This would do it, but this costs mana. I want to do it without using mana. To do it without using mana. This doesn't help, does it? No. Does this help? Weird. Weird, weird, weird. So it's the recharge time that's the problem. There are spells that reduce recharge time, but I don't have them. The good news is, I can fit this. Where's my crit? Where's my crit? I could also fit the crit. What is making a noise? Oh, I was glitched. Cool. I want this to be a triple. If we make it a double, it's way slower. Triple is necessary. Quad doesn't help. Just verifying. So, the good news is, I have plenty of mana if I'm shooting at that speed. That means that I could change one of these out with like this. I don't think I could do it with a pinpoint. No, that adds cat. Oh, but I'm not even using the cast delay. Ooh, I could use that. Huh. What else could I use? So I can put this crit on here. I just don't know this spell well enough. An extremely concentrated point of light that explodes after a moment. Maybe that's really good. Venomous Curse is not that good. We could do this. I think this wants to be really long-lived. Hmm. I could be doing a payload. Which is what I would like to do on this wand, but I can't. Spells cast two. That messes with it a little bit, but you would just have one chainsaw outside of the payload. I took away a chainsaw. Why did I do that? To get rid of the cast delay. If I'm getting rid of the cast delay, I should put these back on here. I'm just looking at what else I do for this wand. I could put this on here, but then it drains too much mana. Does it drain too much mana? It does. God, one more chainsaw would go crazy. I feel like that's decent. This one goes on to three. It was already on three. This wand is garbage. Why are we keeping it? I don't know. All right. This boss isn't even hard. 
This boss isn't even hard. So I could kill it with this. But it would be more fun to kill it with the explosions, except there is lava around here. But I have ice. The explosions are not doing that much damage. I just got lit on fire. Not cool. Why would you light me on fire? So now, what is the item that you drop? Where is it? Slimy green meat. I'm eating it. Oh god, it made me sick. Okay, now we're gonna vomit for a little bit. If I go through here, we die. The game also ends. I don't want to teleport through lava. This will drain out. It just takes forever. If my shots were better, I could freeze this up. Okay, it is draining out. I'm supposed to get a thing from completing that. I don't see the thing. Portal to the work. I think I'm supposed to get a thing. Oh, I got the thing. It's up here. Weird. Is that always up there? I guess so. So yeah, now the question is, do I just end this run and we could start a new one? We could win the game. Or do we go back up and try and turn this into a super run? Which is what I lean towards. Because I've already beat the game a few times, but I have not had a super successful super run yet. And we have the pieces. Oh, that statue just scared the crap out of me. Why would you do that? We have two black holes, so I could make it back up. That's one of the main things you need to make it. I don't have a way to speed those up, but still, we could make it up with those, no problem. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you think. Should I just end this run, start a new one, or should we continue on? For now, that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for watching.